Hey guys, welcome to MKO Studio. I'm Tina and this is Mike. Thank you for joining us today. And today we're going to do two different paintings. Yep. I'm going to be doing a two cup flip cup pour with blues and greens. What are you going to do? Um, I'm going to do a swipe, double swipe. I go, I'm swiping two different sides of the board. You'll see as that goes. Um, but today I'm going to be doing something we haven't done in a very long time. What's that? I added silicone to my swipe. Yep. And we haven't done that in a long time because the prep of cleaning it was a nightmare. But we've had suggestions of how we could do it without having to clean it up too good. So this is my guinea pig. So even if it doesn't come out good, it'll still be a test run. Yeah, and basically what we found out is if you're going to use a spray varnish, you don't have to do all the cleanup with the silicone that we thought you had to do. Now, if you're going to epoxy it, you do have to do all the prep to clean off all your silicone. Which is a real nightmare. A lot of um, uh, it's just corn a, starch. Yeah, it's involved. Yeah, it's it really involved. is involved. And we're not sure if just using the spray works. We just were told it does. All right, well, I guess I'll go first. How's that? That sounds great to me. All right, Take awesome. it away. Today I'm using some leftovers I had. I'm using Artist Loft Deep Magenta, Master's Touch Crimson, Artist Loft Brilliant Red, Liquitex Thalo Blue, Artist Loft Carillion Blue, and Liquitex Turquoise Blue. I'm also using Amsterdam Titanium White for my base. I had some leftover that I thinned out even more um, that I'm going to add silicone to. In fact, let me do that now. So we got this Cell Magic, which is silicone. And I'm going to try to put like three drops in here, I think should be sufficient. One, two, three. I'm going to give that a light mix. This is my consistency on, on the swipe color. About a one, it's going right in. My consistency on my other colors is about a two. It makes a little bit of a mound. So we're using 12 by 16 canvases today. It requires 7.5 ounces of paint. I'm gonna base out with my uh, white here. I got six ounces in here. I'm gonna be adding more paint later. So I don't wanna over soak my board and deal with the cracking. So I'm just gonna go ahead and spread this out. This doesn't have silicone in it. The only thing that has the silicone is the swipe white. All right, so let me do my blue first. I'm gonna go lighter to darker. So I'm gonna call this my halfway point, right about there. Take my white with my silicone in it. I'm going to use this piece of plastic. And let's swipe away. Wipe this off. Contemplating double swipe in this. I'm gonna swipe it again. I'm not gonna add any more color. I'm gonna try to get it so I can keep the edges all the way. Catch 
فکر شده نمیشه رو کنم That's without wiping it off, which isn't horrible. Let's start with my bright red up here. White with the silicone again. Oh, I did not want to grab that blue. Oh, bless. Not what I wanted. Might want to pull a little bit more of your white. Because... Yeah, this is not what I wanted, but it'll be what it is. I don't want that blue in there. And yet, it's telling me you want the blue. Do not want that blue. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get rid of it, though. I'm trying to figure out how to save this. It's not, it's not a total disaster. I know my colors aren't going to be like I wanted, but... And it's closer to where I wanted to be. Vivid. Wow, look at that. I got a bunch of paint left on my swiping thing. So I got these 5 by 7 canvas panels. I'm going to do a dip and squeeze. I love the way that looks. So I want to see what happens here. You're not getting on there, paint. It came out pretty good. I got a little bit of the blue in there I didn't want. Going back the second time helped. I have that fire ice look. I got a lot of cells. Uh, we're going to find out how that silicone works. I had so much paint left over from the red pull. I went and did these quick panels, see how they come out. And I'm going to let this go ahead and dry and see if I can't get any paint skins out of it because it's pretty cool looking. And if I can't, whatever, we wash it off, start over. But, you know, figure, give it a try, see what we can do with some paint skins. This center. Oh. You can do this. See what happens with this.
She's too much white there. I just don't like that. I like that better than white blow. I'm done. I'm done playing with it. Done. Done. And the colors I'm using today is Artist Loft Titanium White, Deco Art Dazzling Metallics Ice Blue, Deco Art Met Metallics Teal. I'm also using more titanium white for my second cup. I'm using Artist Loft Emerald Green and Deco Art Extreme Sheen Emerald. And the consistency I'm using today is about a level two. Makes just a small mound and folds in. All right, so I'm gonna do a double flip cup pour today. Like I said, one with blues, one with greens. Only have three colors for each cup. So I'm gonna start pouring those in. I'm not gonna layer them. I'm just gonna hold up kinda of high and let them uh, blend in with each other. So I think I'll start with my greens first. I'm gonna start off with some white in the bottom. And I'll start with my greens. All right, that's my green cup. Now for my blues. Again, I'm gonna start with some white on the bottom. See how pretty those are, because they're all mingled in. So with two cups, I can take the first one and put it on my board. Or you can have your husband help you and we can do them both at the same time. I'll just do it. So with two cup, you can take your first cup and I want to kind of set it in the middle on one side and I'm going to flip it. My second one. Right over here to the side of this and flip. There we go. Now we have to wait a few minutes and let this paint flow down. 
it will take it a few minutes so um, I'll be back in just a couple minutes I'm gonna let this flow all right so I've let these sit here it's been at least five minutes and you can see the dark green here that most of the paint has come down so with the flip cup it's hard to master I'm on, I haven't done one of these in quite a while but when you grab it you want to pull up on the cup slide up a little bit and pull back so let's see what I can do here whoops whoops so I'm going to pull that down a little bit just to start off here I'll run that there <clears throat> All right, let's see what I can do any better on this one. Got to do it fast, though. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of a... Shovel. <laughs> shovel there. Although I kind of like how it pushed that out there. You might want to run that other cup up through. I know, that looks pretty cool, don't yeah, it? Yeah, go for it. I don't know if that, how that is going to work. Okay, get a little swirl in there. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of flow extender down. Flow extender? That's what it's called. I found out. The flow extender. Yep. <laughs> the flow extender. That's what it's called. Alright. <clears throat> That's cool. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and lay some flow extender down just to help this flow. It extends the flow. Yes, it does. Need much here on the blue. Now I'm going to tilt. Put a lot of paint on here. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of even this out and come to the front first. Boom. And I'm going to take it back. Got to get to some corners. And we're going to go back down to the bottom corner.
let's get some green over here. Blue on here. Yeah, I'm gonna scrape my sides to stop the paint from continuously flowing so it won't mess up the composition we have. Sometimes you may have to do it a couple times. And I'll probably come back in about five minutes and may have to do it again. See if we can get any more sales in here. Looks awesome. Thank you. Well, that sure was fun, don't you think? Yes. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. Enjoyed paint with you, baby. Yeah. Did I? Yeah. Uh, I love the cells I got with this. We'll see how the top coat works. The silicone definitely brought out a lot of cells. Uh, I like my middle much better than it was when it was just too much white. At least this way, it's a little, I don't know. Colorful. Colorful. Yeah. And then uh, these over here, we'll see how they come out. That's something that can be embellished. We'll see how the paint skin comes out after over time. And uh, overall, I'm happy. And like I said, this is really just my, you know, lab rat to find out if I can actually do the silicone without problems. So if it goes to junk on me when I spray the stuff on it, I'll be like, all right, at least I knew I was going into it with that. So I'm kind of glad it's not a masterpiece. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's pretty cool though it is pretty cool and i hope if it comes out it's gonna be good yeah so well just like yours is a two color i've got a two color you do and yours yeah, is awesome yeah thank you so i'm glad i did the flip cup with those two colors today blue and green do complement each other i like the way the mingling that i got with um pouring the paints up high instead of just layering it mm-hmm so they did mingle throughout as it laid down. I love the lacing. Oh, yeah. The cells we got in here, and that comes from that Deco Art uh, Dazzling Metallics. Yes. And I did take my uh, torch. Got a little bit more white to come up here, like a little border on this green. I just sprayed a little bit closer, but kept it moving. You got a lot of, like, uh, layer look. You know what I'm saying? It does. It looks like layers. So. Versus the, the, this side, you have a lot of lacing and cells. This right. one is kind of layered. Yeah. Same technique, but just came out a little different. Yeah. And I, it could be that that particular paint gave more cells. Right. So. Different paints do give different cells. More cells. But it's cool. This. It's like uh, the ocean coming up to the marshlands. So. It does kind of look that way. Yeah. It's cool. I'm, I really am happy with it. I yeah. hope you are. Yeah. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. Ring that bell. And then click all so you'll be notified every time MKO Studio puts out a new video. We hope you would like this video. Share it with friends and family. Uh, drop us comments, hints, ideas, whether you liked it or not. Um, we'll get back to you eventually with the, the silicone thing when it cures and all. Mm -hmm. So... Don't blow me up with those comments yet. Yeah, so once he top coats it with the varnish, we will um, put that out there and let you know how that worked. I might even do a video on t doing that. Yeah, do the test. Yeah. Yeah, we can yeah. do that. Yeah, we can do a video of that. Yeah. Yeah. And then you're welcome to save this video by clicking the save button, and that way you can get back to it a whole lot quicker. Till next time, y'all. Be blessed. Bye. Thank you for watching.